if you have WordPress website or even a WooCommerce WordPress website, it is important to allow customers to log into your WordPress website or WooCommerce website, of course. If you want to enable that functionality, then this video is for you. Now, if you go to your website and if you go to my account page, you find just a login page and there is no sign up section. Let me show you how to enable that section. If you are running a WordPress WooCommerce website, your customer can go to the shop page and then add any product to the cart. Just imagine this one. Just tap to cut and if I check out, you can see here on the checkout page, customer can fill out all the information and can purchase this product successfully. Yet, he or she can't open the account and that is the trick here. So if you want to disable the guest checkout and enable the login or sign up the account section, simply go to your WordPress admin dashboard here. Simply select settings and general settings and on the general settings, simply scroll down and you will find this option called membership. Simply tick the tick box, anyone can register. Make sure this option is enabled. Once it's done, simply say changes. And then on the left hand side panel, select WooCommerce. If you are a WooCommerce user, go to settings, go to account and privacy. And here you have to do a few things. So first of all, in the checkout section, enable guest checkout. I would not recommend this one. This is not the safe option. I would highly suggest users must register for the account. So make sure they enable login during checkout or they can create the account during checkout. So even though if they don't have account, they can always create the account during checkout. So simply select that option under the account creation. Also, you can allow them to create an account in the my account page by selecting or ticking the tick box. For extra security purposes, you can also go with this option, account creation option, select send password setup link. I would tick the tick box and that's it. So this will allow your customers or visitors to create an account on your website. Once you're done, simply save changes. And let me open the website again. So let me go to home page here. And if I go to login or my account section, any of these ones, now you can see there is another section showed up here, which is register section. And now customer can enter the email address and register for the account. Also, another thing is like if you go to cart page and checkout page, here you will find another option called login. So as a customer, if I want to log in directly here, I can click to this and it will drag me to my account page. So that is how you can allow your customers to create an account on your website. Hope this video has been helpful to you. Thumbs up to this video if you feel like it and subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon if you're here for the first time. Comment me in comment box below if you have any questions or suggestions. Until next time, take care and see ya.